What's up everybody, it's April Laura, your Florida Realtor, and today I am back in Boca Raton in one of the most sought after, family friendly, great school zoned areas in West Boca. So stick around, cause we're gonna go tour this beautiful home. So today I'm back in West Boca Raton. West Boca Raton is really known for its family friendly feel. There are some wonderful, great neighborhoods in this area. Most people pick it because honestly, you get a lot more for your money. When you go west in the Boca Raton area, the further west you go, the more land you may get, the more square footage you will get for the price per square foot. So not only that, but there are a lot of great schools all over Boca Raton, but when it comes to A-rated schools, schools, which is what most parents look for. And when they're searching in the areas, you're going to find a lot of A-rated school zones in that area. I always refer my buyers and my clients to bestschools.org and niche.com is another website that you should check out when you're checking the areas, the school zones, and all of the things. Now, what's great also is that this is a very, very mature neighborhood, which means it's been there for a really long time, a few decades. They started building this whole area, I think in the 1980s. Recently, in the last few years, they did upgrade the amenities in Boca Falls. So it's a very, very beautiful neighborhood. It's about, I think, 720 some odd homes. So it's a pretty large neighborhood. It's got a really nice gate, a manned gate, which is nice. And like I said, all of the amenities, the clubhouse, the all of the things that they have there have been updated. So that's nice because although it's a mature neighborhood, you have updated amenities and all of the families just love the amenities. So lots to do there. And as far as the location, you are just a few minutes away from 441 and on the corner of 441 in Glades you have all of the big box stores so there's just several shopping plazas and shopping centers on all four corners there right down the road you have Uptown which is one of the newer shopping plaza developments in Boca Raton which is right kind of across the street from the new Lotus development and that's new construction and in the new Lotus development development, you're not gonna get into that development at this point for under probably like 1.4 million, and that's the smallest home. Gorgeous, modern, beautiful development. In some of the more mature neighborhoods, you're just gonna get a lot more for your money. So I love to show homes in this neighborhood. I love to show new properties as well, but everybody just needs a little bit of variety, and it's just great to see what types of different neighborhoods, different price points will get you. Now, in this location, you are a good 30, maybe even 35 minutes away from the actual ocean and beaches. What you do there is you just plan a day at the beach and you pack up the family and the kids, go over to the beach, spend the whole day there, enjoy and come back. It's not that big of a deal. I've lived in Florida all my life and I don't really go to the beach that often. Now, boating is another thing, but you know, it's just different strokes for different folks. Some people don't even like the beach. They wanna to go to the pool. And the clubhouse is gonna have a beautiful pool area for you and your family to enjoy. Along with shopping, amenities, there are also wonderful parks in this area. Now, there are some large parks here and they even have like water skiing on the lake. They have an amphitheater. They've got public golf courses, private golf courses. There's a lot of options within a 15 minute drive in this area, so you, sh you should definitely check it out. I actually did a video a couple years ago on like the four best neighborhoods in West Boca, so I'm gonna link that right about here and definitely check that one out because it has a little more information on all of those neighborhoods, not just Boca Falls. So the house we're going to tour is a four bedroom, three bathrooms, and a three car garage. It has a beautiful pool area. It's a nice, large, paved, screened-in enclosure, a nice, large lanai. So the outside living area is really spectacular, and actually the interior has been completely renovated. Now, is it to your taste? We'll see. Definitely drop a comment. Let me know if you like the aesthetic of the home. But they have really completely done this home as far as renovated it, and they opened up, you know, a small wall overlooking the kitchen, so you have like a bar area. You really kind of have like a, a chef's kitchen. I like the 
color combination that they chose in this kitchen because like dark blue on the bottom and I think gray. So it's really nice. It's very well done. This house does have an original roof and it was built in 2000. It's a barrel tile roof. Those usually last a good 30 years. So there's probably five years left on the life of that roof. That may or may not get you into some issues with insurance rates. That's something that you always have to keep in mind. And also the only other thing, it does have hurricane protection, but it does not have hurricane impact windows. So it is listed right now at 1,299,000. What do you think about this house? Should it have a new roof and the impact windows? I'm sure most people are gonna say yes, but you're gonna find this a lot. You're gonna find that in more mature homes where they have hurricane protection. It may not be impact in the form of impact windows, but you're still gonna get credit on the insurance side. And I think that's what the sellers kind of in their brains, that's what they're thinking. Like we have hurricane protection in some way, shape or form. It doesn't have to be impact. Are you enjoying this information? Well, hit that like button and definitely share this video with somebody you think might enjoy it.
um, wait, not older. Um, um, but in order to find that perfect place that you may be thinking of or wanting to go see, make sure you give us a call, send us a text, shoot us an email, somehow get in touch with us because I've got your back when you're moving to Florida. And until next video, I'll catch you later.